Congratulations, sir. Congratulations, sir. Congratulations, sir. Today is indeed a memorable day in the annals of our state. Yes. The Enugu State Election Petition Tribunal has just affirmed the mandate you, Ndi Enugu, freely gave us on the 18th of March this year. This is indeed victory for Ndi Enugu. It is also victory for democracy. It is a victory for massive development for Ndi Enugu. It is a victory for exponential growth for Ndi Enugu. It is a victory for Enugu's greatness. It is a victory for the ban on Monday's seat at home. Yes. Finally, it is also victory for our determination to restore water in all your homes in the next 68 days. We are thankful to God because we know it would not have been possible without God. Yes. We also want to put on record our deep appreciation to their Lordship for painstakingly dissecting the petitions brought before them and also coming out with a judgment that resonates with the people of Enugu State. A judgment that is fair and just. Yes. Indeed, this has reaffirmed our belief in the judiciary as the last hope of the common man. Yes. For us, as you know, there is time for everything under the sun. There is time to strive and there is time to unite. Politics is over. It is, as you know, we, we have begun governance since May 29. And our arms are open and wide. We beckon on those our brothers we ran this race with to join hands with us to deal with the task ahead the task of building the Enugu of our dreams. So we are going to be urging you, our supporters, to indeed be magnanimous in victory. Let us all join hands together to build the Enugu of our dream. At the end of the day, Enugu is greater than all of us. We had put ourselves forward to serve in the Enugu. So if the motivation is service, it is now time for us to come together and join hands to deal with the onerous task ahead of us, which is building the Enugu state of our dreams. Once more, I want to thank immensely the good people of Enugu State, who not only believed in us, but vested their mandates in us, but above all had also stood by us every step of the way. I want to assure them that I'm going to work for them with every fiber of my being. I stand by the campaign promise I made as espoused in our statement of purpose. I also stand by the citizens' charter that I executed on my first day of office. Let them hold me. The Enugu people should hold me to account. I will not let them down. May God bless Enugu State.
and may God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Thank you.